Hello and welcome. Now in this video what we're going to do is we are going to create a PayPal button for your digital product and so we're going to log in to PayPal to get started. Now once you log into PayPal what you're going to do is you're going to click on selling tools here. And once you click on selling tools you're going to click on this button that says create payment buttons for your website. Once you've done that you're going to click the create a button that's going to bring you to a three-step process and this is step one you're going to make sure this is buy now you're going to give your product a name and an ID you can make that whatever you want it to be okay once you've done that you're going to give yourself a price here and once you have your price you're going to leave this area blank it's a digital product so you're not going to have any shipping and you want to make sure that you're doing taxes according to your local area um, I don't typically have to put anything there so now once you do that what you're gonna do now is you are then gonna go to step two step two I like to save all my buttons at PayPal so I'll know what I did and sometimes I like to go back and redo a process or take less steps to do a future process so um, you can save all your buttons at PayPal I don't track inventory and in general you're not gonna be tracking profits and losses unless this is going straight into your accounting system you're then going to move on to step three. Um, you don't want your customer to change order quantities. Uh, you want to make sure that they're not adding special instructions and messages back to you. Um, you're not going to use their shipping address. You want to make sure you click no. In general, you can you can put something here. It's optional if you have something there. Uh, what I like to do is just go straight to this area um, and take my customers to the URL when they finish the checkout. This is where you're going to put your download link or wherever the customer is going to have to go to sign up for your membership site or wherever they're going to get the product delivered. If you have an, a one-time offer or an upsell, you're going to put the link to the upsell in this box. So wherever they go right after checkout, this is where you want to put that specific URL. Now, once you've done all those things, you want to go ahead and click the Create button. That's going to bring you to the add button code to your web page. You're going to click the email tab here. And then this is the link that you want to connect to your order button. So you want to go to your HTML page. You want to put the link to this button so that whenever the customer clicks the link or clicks your uh, payment button that they get sent to your PayPal. We've already made sure that the link inside of PayPal delivers them straight to the product or to the upsell offer. And that, friends, is how you create a PayPal button for your digital product. So with that, friends, make sure that you are subscribed to all of our other videos. Um, you can go to youtube.com forward slash game mindshare. And with that, thanks, and I will see you in another video.